So over here in Adobe Acrobat Pro, you can also use stamps to approve some documents. In order to use the stamp tool, I can go into tools right here. And over here, you'll be able to find stamp. So stamp is uh, over here in review and approve. And you can add this on onto your right hand window right here. So let me just click on stamp. And once I do that, you can see that you get the stamp tools. And once you go into the stamp, you can see that approved is the regular stamp. So I can just choose this. And you can also add in your name. So this is the login name that I have. So let me just add in tutor tube. So I'm just going to do that. I'm not going to add any other details. So I'm just going to update it, click it. And there you go. There's my stamp right here. And if you had to right click, go into its properties, you'll be able to see that this is the author and review history. Everything is approved right there. So that's the stamp right here. There's dynamic stamp right here, like revise. So once you click on this, you can see that the uh, date and the day appears as well along with uh, the timestamp right there. You, you can also go over here and there's a reviewed. So you can see that this is reviewed by TutorTube there. So there are different stamps which is actually generate for, uh, generated for you just like that. You can also sign here and then you can add in witness just like that. And you can also uh, have things like check marks just like this. And you also have uh, see here that there's standard business like final completed for public release and so forth. So a lot of stamps actually given to you so you can also so stamp names right here and then uh, you can see that all of the stamps are there so once you show stamp names only the stamp names are there right here. let me disable it and it'll go back to the graphics once you go to stamp palette you can see that there are a lot of palettes so you can see so these are some dynamic palettes which changes according to the time and date you can also go over here there's sign here stamps right here there's also standard business stamps and favorite stamps you can also import uh, some files right here which is in jpg format so let's say you want to have um, some pictures like this as a stamp you can just select this press open and that image is actually imported and it can be used as a stamp so you can change this as a stamp so and you can change this out into standard business stamp press ok and the stamp will be there in standard business so you go down there's the stamp right here so once you do that you, uh, you'll be able to access the stamp right here so, so this is quite a big of a stamp right here as you can see and the stamp is applied so let me just press ctrl z to actually now uh, rebut that up. So there's some custom stamps as well. You can create a stamp right here and then select it. It's simply the same as importing a stamp right there. So that is how you can use the stamp tool inside of Adobe Acrobat Pro DC to um, add in um, add in review and approved uh, stamps in some side of PDF documents. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.